Okay, so this is going to be the next uh, Crash Course tutorial, and it's going to be covering just the keywords. So the keywords are, um, for now, just public, static, and class. So public means that any, um, any, any class that has a reference to this class can see this, whatever it is. So if it's a function, you can see the function. If I did public car here, um, anywhere can see this character. Um, that's it for public. Uh, if you wanted to say that um, only this class can see it, you'd say private. So all, all um, references are private by default if you don't specify. Um, then you have, so class says that this is actually the opening class brace. So each class, you should save it into a separate um, file so class my class would have a my class java file but you can actually put another class in here if i do class my class 2 that would still work it should still compile but you want to have them in their own files just for um organizational purposes um so yeah, so that's that. Um, static means that this void is non-changing and it only exists once. So this uh, function, I mean. Um, and yeah, so anything that's static can only call static, right? So unless you've created an instance of an object. So we'll get around to that later, but um, if it's a static void main and it wants to call a function, that function has to be static. It can't be changing. It can't. Sorry, it can't be just be a void like that. Otherwise, when you compile it, you'll get. Oh, that's a different thing. Um, you'll get another error there. You get this one. The so non-static method cannot be referenced from a static context, right? So if it's not static, it can't be referenced from a static. That's literally what it means. Alright, and that's it for keywords for now.